Hey everybody, this is Mark Rollins from The Geek Church, and they are gonna be reviewing another Rocket product. Remember, I used to pronounce it Rocat, but apparently it's pronounced Rocket, as in like, man, this thing is gonna rock it. And today we got something that's gonna rock you. This is the, um, I believe it's pronounced Kone, because it's spelled K-O-N-E, we're just gonna go with that. It could be pronounced Kone. I don't know, there's no accent there, so we're just gonna pronounce it. You know what, I just, I'm gonna go all out. This is the Kone Pro. Because honestly, you're probably gonna read the, the words that we've written up there anyway, as far as what the descriptor is for this. This is a gaming mouse. Um, and I'm told this is the finest gaming mouse the company has produced. So, it's very hard for any company to say that this is the finest thing they have, but apparently this thing is 14 years in the making. I find it very hard to believe that somebody would spend 14 months building a gaming mouse, but hey, this is what we got here. Now, does it live down to its name? I'd say yes. I like the ergonomic shape. Notice how this thing is here. And it looks pretty good. We got this nice clicker wheel. And we got some buttons on the side here. Probably set up some macro. Uh, macros, is that the right word? Macros. Macros, there we go. Okay, here's the deal. Professional gaming is like a thing I really don't know about. And honestly, I don't really, if this thing can get you more game on your game, See how unhip that sounded? Um, yeah, that's pretty much how that works. Uh, here's the box it comes in. I've already unboxed it, as you can see. Comes with this little guide and then these little pads here. I imagine these pads will help you out. Uh, once again, I don't really know much about the game, but hey, this is it's here. You might be asking, Mark, isn't that the photo spring uh, thing you just reviewed? And I said, yes, I just found out um, and because I wanted to show you an example of this thing in action, I just found out that this photo spring frame is compatible with mice. And this might be the reason why there's a USB port on the back of this thing, which I reported about and said something like, why do they have this thing? I tried to put upload photos to it and I couldn't do it. Well, here's gonna be the surprising answer. Oh, and yes, there's another big reveal coming up here. This thing has pretty lights on it. So let's see the pretty lights. Da, 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 da. Oh, why is it always possible that I do this the wrong way every time? You know? And then I do it again because apparently I had it right the last time. Oh man. <laughs> Alright, are we getting this good? Okay, oh look at how pretty that I noticed that this little honeycomb shape here, that's kinda cool. So, um, yeah, I can imagine there's probably some uh if I know these gaming products, they usually have some like included software which allows you to uh, alter this thing. But as you can see, I got this, some red, purples, probably all the colors of the rainbow here, honestly. So I'm guessing you can probably see that, hey, there's a little arrow on the screen. I totally don't know if we're picking this up, but trust me, this is how the mouse is working. Now, honestly, I probably didn't have to give you this demonstration, but I've got to bring my laptop uh, in on this one and. I figured like, hey, if you wanna see this mouse in action. Okay, is this good gaming for you guys? Oh my gosh, look at it. Oh, what happens if I do that? Oh, dude. Hey, dude, I'm scrolling. Yeah, check that out. Huh, not bad. Anyway. So the Kona, Kone Pro gaming mouse, at this time that I'm reviewing this, is not available. Ha ha ha. Yeah, it's available for pre-order. I'm hoping to post this. I'm actually probably under embargo to post this video the moment that, it, that you're able to order it. So when you're able to order it, which should be now, it is $79.99 on the Rocket site. And I highly recommend getting it if it's um, your thing. This is the it, it in white. I think it comes in black. It's a pretty decent mouse. So check it out if you're interested in it. And this is Mark Rollins from the Geek Church signing off.